confusion broke out at one of the registration centers in the constituency when some members of the NDC questioned the rise of some applicants to register. This resulted in disagreement between NDC and MPP members at the center. One of the NDC members who allegedly attacked a community police officer sustained injuries after a clash with some security personnel. Two persons were arrested but were later granted bail. Police commander in charge of Kumeu and Drobonsu districts tells City News personnel will ensure a peaceful exercise going forward. What we did yesterday, for them to know that police presence is here, now I know that they will comport themselves. And even the MP has assured us that he will advise his people, and the MPP also has advised us that he will ad um, advise his people so that everything will go on smoothly. NDC regional executives who were in the area accused district chief executive for Setre Afram planes of using state security to intimidate their members. We have also observed uh, that it does appear that the police are at the mercy of the DISEC. Coincidentally, the district chief executive for the Setre Afram planes district happens to be the parliamentary candidate for the MPP. And thus, he seemed to have absolute control over the activities of the Ghana Police Service. And we find that unfortunate. But let us also place on record that we are for peace. We don't believe in touchery. But the observation we have made so far in this constituency gives us cause to believe that there's some exceptional determination by the ruling government to use every means possible to annex the seat from us. Let the right things be done. If legitimate means are deployed, and eventually it so happens that we know can never be the case that somebody else wins an election, we are okay. The DCE for Setre Afram Plains, who is also the parliamentary candidate for the MPP in the area, has denied the claims. But for people who come in peace, they will have their peace to register. So when the time comes, they will have the chance to vote for whoever they prefer to vote for. Even a security officer has no right to tell me that somebody has reported that this person doesn't hail from this place, so he can't be in the queue. The security officer can determine who can join the queue. And you, the floating, unassigned party apparatchik, you have no right to forcefully pull anybody from the queue. Only right you have under the regulations is to alert your party agent that this person coming up I have this and that information that he doesn't qualify to register here. And that agent, by law, can fill a challenge form, as simple as ABC. And I don't see how this should even beat the understanding of the NDC. If it's not something that is planned to cause mayhem, why would you have difficulty in understanding such a simple rule? Military officers have been deployed to the area to help police maintain order at the various registration centers.